KYB, or Know Your Business, is described as a fundamental component in the compliance and risk management process, designed to ensure a comprehensive understanding of corporate entities and their associated risks. But who exactly should conduct a KYB? And why is it important? In today's video, we will be taking a look at what is a KYB, who should conduct the KYB process, and why is KYB important? Hello, and welcome to another KYC Lookup video, where we bring you AML-related content to help you enhance your knowledge in the fight against money laundering. Before diving into today's video, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any future videos. Oh, and don't forget to leave us a comment with any suggested topics you would like us to cover in the future. So, on to today's video. What is KYB? KYB stands for Know Your Business, similar to the concept of Know Your Customer KYC. KYB is a process that businesses and financial institutions use to identify and verify the information of their corporate clients. KYB is crucial in preventing fraud, money laundering and other illicit activities within the business environment. Who conducts the KYB process? The Know Your Business process is conducted by the businesses and financial institutions themselves as part of their due diligence and risk management practices. Typically, internal teams such as compliance officers, risk management teams or dedicated departments within the organisation are responsible for carrying out the KYB process. These teams collect and verify information about other businesses to assess risks, ensure compliance with regulations and make informed decisions when entering into transactions or partnerships. Additionally, some organisations may rely on third-party service providers that specialise in KYB services to assist in verification and validation of business information. What does the KYB process involve? The KYB Know Your Business process involves gathering and verifying information about a corporate entity to understand their ownership structure, business activities, financial health and associated risks. The specific steps in the KYB process may vary, but typically include Business identification Collecting basic information about the business such as its legal name, registration number and physical address. Ownership structure Identifying and verifying the ownership structure of the business, including details about beneficial owners and major stakeholders. Financial information Assessing the financial health of the business by reviewing financial statements, credit reports and other relevant documents. Business activities Understanding the nature of the business, its industry and the products or services it provides. Regulatory compliance Ensuring that the business complies with applicable laws and regulations in its operating jurisdiction. Risk assessment. Evaluating the level of risk associated with a business, including potential exposure to money laundering, fraud or other illicit activities. Documentation review. Examining official documents such as business licences, certificates of incorporation and any other relevant legal documents. And ongoing monitoring. Establishing mechanisms for continuous monitoring of the business relationship to detect any changes in risk factors or compliance status. As you can see, the Know Your Business KYB process is an integral aspect of the due diligence designed to provide a comprehensive understanding of the corporate entities. By looking into ownership structure, financial information, business identification and compliance with regulations, organisations can mitigate risks, prevent financial crimes and make informed decisions. 
What could happen if you do not conduct the KYB process? Failure to conduct the KYB Know Your Business process can expose businesses and financial institutions to various risks and consequences. Here are some of the potential outcomes. Increased risk of financial crimes. Without a thorough understanding of the businesses with which you engage, there is a higher risk of becoming unwittingly involved in financial crimes, such as money laundering, fraud, or other illicit activities. Regulatory non-compliance. Many jurisdictions have strict regulations and legal requirements, mandating businesses to conduct KYB as part of their due diligence and compliance efforts. Failing to comply with these regulations can lead to legal consequences, fines or regulatory sanctions. Reputational damage. Being associated with businesses engaged in illegal or unethical activities can harm your organization's reputation. Customers, partners and stakeholders may lose trust, impacting your brand image and long-term relationships. Financial loss. Engaging with businesses without proper KYB can lead to financial losses due to fraud, contractual disputes or business failures that could have been identified and mitigated through a comprehensive due diligence process. Increased operational risk. Lack of knowledge about the businesses you work with may result in increased operational risk as you might not be adequately prepared for potential disruptions, changes in ownership, or other factors affecting your business relationships. Legal consequences. In some cases, failure to conduct KYB may expose your organisation to legal action, especially if your business transactions are later found to be associated with illegal or prohibited activities. Loss of business opportunities. Many reputable and compliant partners may refuse to engage in business relationships with entities that do not adhere to KYB processes. This can limit your access to valuable partnerships and opportunities. And suspension of services. Financial institutions, in particular, may suspend or terminate services for clients who do not comply with KYB requirements as part of their own risk management and compliance protocols. To mitigate these risks and ensure a secure and compliant business environment, it is essential for organisations to prioritise and diligently conduct the KYB process as part of their due diligence efforts. Examples of companies not conducting the KYB process. There have been instances where companies have faced fines and penalties for failing to conduct or inadequately conducting the Know Your Business KYB process, especially in the context of anti-money laundering AML and counter-financing of terrorism CFT regulations. These fines are often imposed by regulatory authorities as a result of non-compliance with established standards and legal requirements. Here are a few examples. Deutsche Bank, 2017. Deutsche Bank was fined $630 million by regulators in the United States and the United Kingdom for failing to maintain an effective AML program, including deficiencies in conducting due diligence on its customers. Danske Bank, 2018. Danske Bank faced significant penalties and investigations after a money laundering scandal involving its Estonia branch. The bank was criticised for inadequate KYC and AML procedures, resulting in substantial fines and damage to its reputation. Commonwealth Bank of Australia, 2018 The Commonwealth Bank of Australia faced a hefty fine of 700 million Australian dollars for failing to promptly monitor transactions and report suspicious activities. The lack of effective KYC and AML controls contributed to the regulatory action. Standard Chartered, 2012 
Standard Chartered was fined $667 million by US regulators for violating sanctions against Iran, Sudan, Libya and Burma. The deficiencies in the bank's AML controls and KYC procedures were highlighted during the investigation. Société Générale 2018 Société Générale agreed to pay penalties totaling $1.34 billion for violating US economic sanctions. The penalties were imposed for indeficiencies in the bank's AML controls and KYC processes. These examples underscore the importance of robust KYB processes and effective AML measures to prevent financial institutions and businesses from being used for illicit activities. Regulatory authorities worldwide are increasingly focusing on enhancing compliance and companies that neglect KYB obligations may face severe consequences, including fines, reputational damage and legal actions. It is essential for businesses to prioritise and continually enhance their KYB procedures to stay in compliance with evolving regulations and to mitigate associated risks. Well, there you have it. What is KYB? Who should conduct the KYB process? And why is KYB important? Please let us know in the comments section if you think the KYB process is an important component in the fight against financial crime and any other topics you would like us to cover in the future. We have now launched our very own fully accredited courses for you to take a more in-depth look at a variety of subjects, such as introduction to AML, beneficial ownership and customer risk rating, for example. So make sure you visit our website for further details and let us help you connect the dots in KYC. Thank you for watching the video and if you made it this far, don't forget to like and subscribe to watch more amazing videos.